you are welcome, let's start by adding a video track then dragging down a picture on track 2. Further, right click to crop to fit then extend to 6 seconds. Afterward, click on the crop icon above the timeline, change the ratio to 16 to 9, click pan and zoom above, then adjust the grid as you shown then apply. Go to effect, search for overlay O3 frame border, then drag down to apply. Now go to image, apply keyframe to transform, scale down to 60 as shown. Then go to position X and Y to type 1551 and minus 865 respectively for the animation to come from the right bottom side outside the screen. Now move the play ahead to 2 seconds then go up to restore position to 0 as shown. Again, move the play ahead to 4 seconds and just apply keyframe to position above. Once more, move the play ahead to the end, go up to keyframe to position then go to position X and Y to type minus 1551 and minus 865 respectively as shown. Now go to keyframe panel, highlight all the keyframe point then right click to apply easy in. Let preview. Further, go to effect, search for crop then drag down to apply. Now, let copy and paste 9 times above to make 10 pictures. Now we have 10 pictures. Scroll down then from track 3, move the first keyframe point 5 frames or 1 frame if not expand it forward until the last picture is shown above. Also, go to the end then from track 10 move the last keyframe point 5 frames backward until the first picture. So when you can track the timeline, it just one frame intervals as shown. Now, click the first picture, go to effect then under crop, type 90 in right and 0 in the left box. For the second picture, go to effect then under crop, type 80 in right and 10 in the left box. For the third picture, go to effect then under crop, type 70 in right and 20 in the left box. For the fourth picture, go to effect then under crop, type 60 in right and 30 in the left box. For the fifth picture, go to effect then under crop, type 50 in right and 40 in the left box. For the sixth picture, go to effect then under crop, type 40 in right and 50 in the left box. For the seventh picture, go to effect then under crop, type 30 in right and 60 in the left box. For the eighth picture, go to effect then under crop, type 20 in right and 70 in the left box. 
For the ninth picture, go to Effect then under Crop, type 10 in right and 80 in the left box. For the tenth picture, go to Effect then under Crop, type 0 in right and 90 in the left box. So let preview. Now, highlight all pictures, right click to copy then click the first track and right click to paste as many as you wish. Stating from the second row, just press and hold the ALT key on the keyboard as you drag down same picture to change the pictures on each row till the last row. Further scroll down to track 1 to drag down a background then extend and crop to fit if necessary. Yeah. Lastly scroll up, then go to effect to drag down at full effect, extend to match and click to change its opacity to 30. Also don't forget that the template link for this tutorial is in the description. You're awesome, thanks for watching.